Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Boozer here. Today's video, I will be cracking um, some big soul stones here to participate in the soul stone rush. This is the best opportunity for you guys to use some of your bigger value soul stones if you guys have been saving them up to get some nice juicy rewards. There are definitely some juicy rewards here. However, the price for them is quite expensive. Um, however, I don't think it's un I don't think it's out of the realm of possibility for you to have saved seven big boys to get this sacred shard and basically cash in on all this stuff. It's definitely possible because I actually myself have three, and I would have had more, but I spent some on the last chase one. Um, but anyways, you guys also might have seen some um, additional resources there. We do have a summon pool event going on for the prism crystals uh, you guys all know about this system um, basically there's a you know re rotating pool with rotating cost and rotating percentage chance to pull certain legendaries if this is plarium's like perfect mix for themselves whatever they feel is relevant they'll jam it in this pool jack up the price reduce the reduce the odds change the actual value monetary value of each one of these they sell it's like insanely efficient for plarium for us it gives us like a kind of like a 20x um chance to pull one of these champions so if you guys missed out on my hot tip on how to kind of work these work this system in your favor um prism shards crystals you basically do not um do not click them until you're ready to use them for example if i was able to obtain this 20 piece and this 30 piece do not click them right away if you do not want to use them on the current pool for example if this pool is bad leave those crystals there let them expire they will go to your inbox when this summon pool warriors summon pool ends in four days if those shards are not collected meaning if they're still in your inbox and this event ends those shards would just get added up here however uh, and then you can use them for the next pool. So that's kind of like why I have 60 going into this pool today. Because I saved my shards from my inbox from a previous bad summon pool. And now I have 60 to use on this pool, which is way, way better. To be honest, this is actually a really good pool. Um, for 30, 30 is actually much cheaper than what I thought this would be. Because you're actually looking at uh, Harma, which is like super meta arena champion. And then you have Elva, which is actually kind of really good as well even for like live arena for example uh, and then you have trunda which is super meta right now for like hydra hydra clash and then you have like some you know kind of like average champions i mean jetney is not going to be average jetney is going to be below average but then you have like abbas she hits hard kyoku she can you know stall out some teams valk also you know very useful lissandra be useful and then these epics you have a couple of the mythical fusion pieces here but not all of them most of them are pretty average none of them really stand out allure stands out and that's about it i mean you got the bomb girl here she's part of the mythical fusion thylesia can be pretty good um but yeah they're mostly kind of average oh sorry uh, lady annabelle can solo bombos if you need her then that's great same thing with crimson helm but much more uh, dedicated build and you know requirements are needed for him but yeah, anyways, so that's kind of like my the way I deal with this summon pool stuff. I saved my crystals until the pool I want to use them. So I will be pulling my shards for this pool after uh, I wait until the end. Because I want to see if this lines up with a champion chase. Because with the champion chase, uh, you can when you pull a champion, there will be points for a champion chase. So that's kind of what i'm thinking uh but there's also no reason for me to pull them right away so i can wait for four days to accumulate more and more shards so currently we don't actually have that many events with crystals so anyways i digress uh but i will be snapping these up here so i'll be pulling three big boys and then three small ones uh pick up the promo shard i could pull more to get the six star ore it's not important to me the ore is not relevant i have um I have a ton of ore. I have like 70 ore on this account, so I definitely don't need it. Um, another thing that's going on right now in game, we have this. <laughs> this is actually really sneaky slash really uh, nasty from Plarium because Plarium put Xena um, as a collectible from 10x chance from Ancient Shards only, which is actually bonkers. Uh, why would you do that? 
it's uh, it's yeah it's i don't know i don't know why they would do that they, they're basically doing this to make this champion extremely extremely hard to get extremely extremely inflexible to get so if you were really desperate to get this champion you would you know have to pull ancient shards which are not optimal right so anyways i think yeah just don't just totally ignore this um also in a couple hours we have a one plus one legendary event from sacred shards that will give you when you pull a legendary you'll get an extra legendary so from the big big yellow one if you pull a legendary you'll get one extra one for free um this event i recommend for players that are close to mercies meaning the mercy system for sacred shard is not great you get 60 percent six percent base chance to pull legendary the first shard after your 12th shard that you have not pulled a legendary you will get plus two percent so on your 13th shard you will get eight percent chance and then it'll go up two percent at a time so then it'll be 10 percent. then it'll be 12 percent. i don't have to tell you guys that that's not a great you know percentage odds to pull a legendary but it is what it is if you pull one you get double and it's all it's it's advised to wait until you are kind of deeper into that mercy so your percentages are higher so you don't have to spend so many shards just my two cents but we will have that event coming up and uh yeah so right now i'm just gonna pop these three big boys and see what we get and then uh actually let's pop the three little ones first and then uh yeah we'll collect our collect our goodies and then we'll do um the crystal pulls for a another video at the end of the week so hopefully you guys had some luck with all these summon events i mean they're definitely like they're definitely like strangling us strangling the shards and resources out of us just before this fragment fusion so if you guys also there's a new fragment fusion that's gonna drop on thursday there's a bunch of videos going out on it i got a video coming out on it as well share you share with you guys my thoughts uh, but yeah it's you know they're, they're just strangling like the resources out of you it's just absolutely insane okay let's pop the big boys let's go my strategy for these um soul stones is basically use your high value soul stones for summoning rush and then use your yolo small ones for the champion chase version because you can always get lucky on the small ones um whereas the big ones you just want the guarantee value okay so it's similar how you would game like the summon rush for shards and champion chase for shards it's kind of the same right so so far total garbage i uh, i can't believe this like it's total garbage just total trash right <laughs> oh a legendary it's a bass oh my lord maybe there is boosted a bass chance in the pool right now because she is in that stupid prism summoning pool <laughs> i don't have an abess on this account uh i think uh, but i mean i wouldn't build her out just for a five star uh blessing i think but that's pretty cool to have i mean i don't i don't think i have her actually let's check do i have her do i have her i don't uh it's the crown right the crown no it's the little helmet guy the little helmet means you got her the helmet yeah i don't where is she yeah i don't have her damn <laughs> i think it might be on the other account see that really sucks right like you know like oh i, I pulled something cool i was like nope nope no you don't anyways guys hopefully you guys pulled something nice from some of these events um and i will see you in the next video